<laughs> there's a lot of stuff going on, but you know, uh, probably the topic that's being talked about more than anything else is the issue of the flag uh-huh. and whether we change our state flag. Uh, and on yesterday, I and several other uh, senators introduced a suspension resolution where we can, you know, the deadlines have already passed for general bills, and, and um, uh, we introduced a suspension resolution to have some further consideration of, of uh, uh, putting the matter before the legislature to see if we can get the votes to change the flag. And so the procedure there, for the benefit of our listeners, and I believe it was Senator Simmons, Derek Simmons, right, and Senator right. David Blunt, right. Uh, that uh, really the primary authors of the of the bill. Yeah. And I uh, hope I explained this right, but if that resolution were to pass, it would exempt a flag bill from the deadline is the way I that read it. That is correct. And, and then would that bill require – so does the resolution, Senator, require two-thirds vote to the, pass? The resolution requires – when we suspend the rules, it requires a two-thirds vote to suspend the rules. Okay. And and so in order to get it back before us, uh, two thirds of both bodies would have to vote for it. Okay, so you suspend the rules with two thirds vote. Uh, if that were to pass, that would mean that only this bill, the way the resolution I believe is is drafted, it wouldn't allow the floodgates to open for all legislation. No, no. just this it's bill. Just, just that one just measure. This bill. Yes, one measure. Right uh, to ch- change the flag. So. Is there a specific measure that uh, is referenced in the in the resolution in the concurrent resolution? Yes, uh, it actually uh, uh, calls for them to the legislature to vote on replacing the current flag with what's called the Stennis flag. Okay. So it, so it is very specific in that respect. Yes. It's not just change it yes or no. It is specifically right. to replace right. it. So. Can you hang on for another segment, Senator? Oh, sure, sure, absolutely. Absolutely. We're going to take a break. We're glad to have Senator John Horn in the studio with us, representing Senate District 26. Stay tuned. we got more with Senator. Welcome back, everyone, to the JT Show on Super Talk Mississippi. In the studio, we've got our friend Senator John Horn, representing Mississippi's District 26, which includes Hines and some of uh, Madison County areas. In fact, he informed us that where we're sitting in the studio right now is Inside the senator's district, uh, glad to know that. So we were we were talking before we uh, left for the break about what's going on with respect to the, uh, the resolution uh, to introduce the uh, bill to change the flag, mm-hmm. uh, even though the re- the rules were uh, uh, the deadline, I should say, in accordance with the rules for filing any new bills is past us. I think Tuesday, this past Tuesday. If I, was no, it Monday? passed a long time ago, Okay, back in February. Okay. Mm-hmm. I, so I thought they were still able to introduce once you guys reconvened up until. You, no, you can you can introduce uh, resolutions and and uh, re- revenue measures, uh, okay. but, but um, no, not, not general bills. Okay, I stand corrected. Thanks for, for that. So what this legislation would do, or this resolution, excuse me, would do, is allow a bill to change the flag from the current uh, Mississippi state flag to the so-called Stennis flag, uh, but it takes two-thirds vote in both chambers to suspend the rules. That's correct. To allow a to, to allow for the, sus- the suspension of rules. Right, and only this bill, as we discussed. So we're kind of recapping a little bit. So my next question is: Do you think the votes are there to to get that done? No, no, I don't. Uh, and you know, I talk privately with with my colleagues, and and a lot of them want to see the flag changed. Yeah. Um, but they also want to remain elected, and they believe that uh, if they put their name in support of changing the flag, it's going to take their picture off the wall. Yeah. A- and um, explain what that means to people. Uh, well, well, that, that, that's a euphemism that we use <laughs> regularly. We say, uh, boy, if if if, if, if uh, you, you don't change your vote, they're going to take your picture off the wall. <laughs> you know, and it's. it's it's, you, you'll be defeated, right. essentially. You're no longer in the House you're, you're or the no Senate. You're no longer right. in the House or the Senate. <laughs> and, you know, a, a lot of folks, you know, Mississippi is such a great place, and uh, yet we have some some issues that hold us back, Some of our, our how much we're committed to education is one of them. Uh, but symbolically, the, the flag is one of them, too, whether you most people would admit it or not. It, it, it really, in my opinion, is holding the state back. And, and this wonderful state keeps getting painted with this, with this brush. 
uh, of being a, a, a backwards, uh, racist, um, uh, uh, white supremacist uh, place that that uh, is oppressing black people every which way. And we all know that that's really not true uh, in 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 the, the main in the state. We've changed a whole lot, uh, and we, we've had had a trouble living down that reputation. And our keeping the flag, in my opinion, uh, helps to permeate that that old uh, attitude about Mississippi. I think we've got to show the, the world that we have changed, uh, but uh, uh, it, it's such a an emotional issue that uh, colleagues who don't look like me, who might look more like you, uh, are really fearful of this issue. Uh, they don't they don't want to publicly go on the record as being supportive of, of taking down the flag. Yeah, uh, and uh, so we have a, a question on the text line. This is Andy and Jackson. We'll know how do we set, settle on the Stennis flag for the design? Well, it's it's just what's in the bill. I mean, the the bill yeah. that we're discussing. Right. So uh, certainly, uh, I guess uh, members of the legislature would be free to offer a resolution to, I guess, allow another bill. Once, right? once so. the the resolu- I mean, once the resolution passes to bring the bill before us. Uh, then it could be amended any kind of way. Okay. Yeah. So it's it's not that that's the only option because I know I've heard people say, well, if we're going to change it, they're, they're either for or against the Stennis flag right. as, as the uh, the one to change to. But I just want to follow up on on your statement, Senator, about and and your I think fantastic characterization of our state. We get a bad rap, and I'm certainly not suggesting that we don't have uh, continued progress to make. With respect to race relations, I think you and I would agree to that. But we also do pretty good too. Mm -hmm. I mean, so you you Mm -hmm. can't. It's not. It's not fair just to be 100% critical and and never recognize the positive aspects of of things. And oh, absolutely, absolutely. You know, we've had um, some remarkable progress made in Mississippi, and and, um, you know the. William Faulkner once once was talking to a person from the north about uh, the difference in between how people deal with race in the north versus the south. And he once said, uh, in the north, uh, you hate the individual, but you love the race. In the south, you hate the race, but love the individual. Yeah. There, there are a lot of personal relationships that people have in this state that cross racial lines, gender lines, whatever you want to call it. Uh, but particularly racial lines uh, where where people have friendships and and relationships and understandings with one another that I think uh, are remarkable uh, in this country and and some in some of the best relationships you'll find anywhere in the country. No question about it. Uh, uh, but at, at the same time, we we do have you know, those elements in our society that 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 detract a little bit from that. And and yet it, we 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 I, I would stack Mississippi's race relations against any country any state in the country, uh, uh, pretty much. And and I think we we come out fairly well uh, in 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 that regard. Uh, but the, the 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 issue is is our our reputation, our image, uh, how how it's I think economically holding us back. I think that if we could could put this behind us. Put that flag, which is I think has served its purpose. It's time to put it in a museum and go with something that's that's less divisive than this current flag is, and and something that that also uh, will uh, bring people together. And you, we were talking over the break, and then we got to tell that story. We, we let we let the rest of the world tell our story too much. And Mississippi has got to put resources and effort behind really telling our true story. We have so much. To showcase, absolutely, and and we tend to dwell. Our society thinks think about it. We tend to dwell on everything we don't have, right? Everything right. that's negative, right? And we never accentuate. It seems like, or emphasize, or discuss the positive. And in particular, I, I got to tell you, in my opinion, we probably have greater racial harmony in our state than many that I've traveled in. Mm-hmm. I've traveled in most of them, certainly in the in the business circles. Um, we live on a more integrated basis. Absolutely, we don't have a choice because of. I think, as you're aware, we're somewhere around sixty forty in terms of the uh, composition of our population, white <laughs> we, black. We can't avoid each other. Well, exactly. <laughs> Not only that, if we don't figure out how to get along, right. we're probably would have been gone a long time ago. Frankly, so 
uh, you, you, we got to at least recognize, and, and I know you have, sir, and, and we are today, that there is progress. That doesn't mean you stop. That you always got That's there's always room for improvement, as yes, they say. Yes. Um, but we got to build on our successes and our victories, and not so much dwell on the bad stuff uh, and and the failures. Uh, we got a lot long way to go. And besides changing the flag, uh, w- which is believed is uh, by many is critical uh, to moving forward. We got a lot of other problems we got to work on. Besides mm-hmm. that, we mm-hmm. can't take our eye off that. And my fear is. If we get this change done, we can't just check the box and say, well, we're done. We don't have anything else to worry about. What the heck are you talking about? Yeah, I mean, it, it's, it's a work in progress, and, um, uh, it's, and it's not easy work. Um, it, it takes a, a lot of intentionalness to focus. It. We've got to focus. We've got to, got to, to intend it to, to bring about change and, and to improve. And so, um, uh, you know, this is a, a, a step in our journey. Uh, but we've got to take the step, in my opinion, or else we don't finish the journey. Yeah. So, and the governor said he believes the people of the state, I think he's made that clear, should should make the call. You know, and, and there's some thought um, and some some discussion going on now about uh, another suspension resolution to do just that, to, to okay. put this issue on the ballot either in, in November or in the spring of next year. Uh, and try to, to get it resolved by letting the people vote on it. Um, in 1890, uh, the people voted on the current flag that we've got. We voted again in 2001. And it, it may be that the only way to, to really get this thing resolved is to let the people decide. Yeah. And Senator Kirby offered that that uh, comment as well about what he thought most of uh, the senators, certainly on the Republican side, feel like the people ought to decide as well. That's kind of the feedback he's getting. But we'll see where it goes. Senator, thank you so much for coming on today. Well, it's Gerard, been a you, you're doing a great job, man. Appreciate uh, that. Uh, JT better better be worried about <laughs> I don't the... know about that. But I appreciate you coming on. It's okay. been a pleasure, My sir. My pleasure.